The well-known saying, a man's best friend, really sums up the companionship, loyalty and close bond that we have with our dogs. Come on then, here. I've had dogs since I was very young and I've now got four that live with me here in the Cotswolds. They're all fantastic, but I have an especially close bond with Peg, my loyal sheepdog. She's an invaluable part of my family and the farm team too. Here, Peg. For me, walking my dogs is one of life's greatest pleasures. In fact, dogs are the biggest motivator for physical activity known to science. Mine certainly keep me on my toes. As well as the physical benefits, dog walking is good for mental well-being too. As you stroll along, you can reflect on what's going on in the world and catch up with family and friends. For dogs, sniffing and exploring the world around them is vital. It helps them socialise with other dogs and different people and charge around letting off steam. Without regular walks, dogs can quickly develop negative behaviours. With so many health and well-being benefits from a simple daily dog walk, surely all of us dog walkers are making the most of this wonderful pastime. Well, sadly not. Research carried out by Fourth Glade, which studied the dog walking habits of 1,500 UK dog owners, showed British dog walking is in decline. Only 42% of the nation's dogs are being walked on a daily basis, and the average midweek walk being wrapped up in less than 20 minutes. This is worrying because for dogs to stay mentally and physically well, they need to be walked for at least half an hour every day and up to two hours for more energetic and larger breeds. The survey also revealed that more than half of British dog owners, 58%, aren't walking their dogs as often or as long as they should. Even though more than a third of owners, 36%, know that their dogs are overweight. So what barriers are stopping many of us taking our canine companions out walking? For more than a quarter of people, 28%, it's down to lack of time, whilst 15% say they're simply too tired after work. Dogs behaving badly is an issue too, with 24% of people never letting their dogs off the lead, and around 55% only letting their dogs off the lead occasionally due to concerns for their dog's safety. Here, Peg. Over 90% of dog owners wish they could walk their dogs more often and 96% say walking their dogs makes them feel happy. For inspiration, tips and advice on how to make the most out of your dog walks, then visit Fourth Glade's Great British Dog Walk campaign. And on that note, I'm off to join my local dog walkers. Hello, everybody. Hello, lovely dogs.